side is already complete. First step would be to get your window glaze. You want to do a thin bead of window glaze all around this bead here. Get the, place, the glass a nice soft place to sit. The glazing remains flexible so that way when the window flexes in the wind, the glass doesn't break. Two X's with fine permanent marker on the glass. You want to make sure your glass is spaced out evenly along the edges, <clears throat> making sure it covers the lip. A lot of times you'll find with these old windows that the modern glazing points you get are too long. So I cut them down with side cut pliers to about that size. This is how they come. This is how I put them in. Next step, to secure the glass using your glazing points. your glass is firmly secured in your sash, it's time to start glazing. Now I've seen this done several different ways by several different people. I'm going to show you my technique which seems to work really well for me. I have about 20 years experience doing this, if that means anything. What I do, where you're going to glaze along the edge here, you first firmly press it in with your fingertips. Get as much of that glazing down in there between the glass and the sash as you possibly can. This also helps you get a smoother finish when you go to glaze. Because the glaze doesn't pull back out. It's much easier to smooth out. My high-tech fancy weapon of choice for glazing, simple putty knife. Good firm pressure, nice steady motion. doesn't go past the lip that the glass is sitting on and we'll be able to see the glazing from the inside. This is about what your finished product should look like. Let's clean up the residue from the glaze. Denatured alcohol works the best. Now, just like anything, don't get discouraged if it doesn't come out perfectly the first time. Everything takes a little bit of practice. The good thing to remember about the glazing is you can scrape it back out and put it back in about five or six times before it's too dry to work with. So don't be afraid about making a mistake, you can just do it right over again. Just practice all you want. Once again, this is Tyler Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you want to see more.